Starting with aesthetics, uh, I think this is gonna be very cool looking. Um, I didn't have too many issues while building it, but I did have some. Uh, but we'll talk about that in a bit. So here's it up close. Move downward. Overall, it was a very fun build. Um, when the backpack is up and spread out, it is very uh, back heavy. <laughs> so, without a stand, uh, you would need to like bend his uh, legs backwards in order to, uh, or not bend them backwards, but um, uh, from the hip joint, uh, maneuver them and position them like far back so his top balance would be uh, even. Speaking of the issues with this kit, um, one of the hands, or fingers, uh, this one I had a problem with because, focus, focus, because um, at the uh, ball joints, so the three fingers at the end are all together, and uh, at the top of them, there's ball joints, and at the ball joint, unlike the other fingers, were still connected, and so when I was trying to place them in, I <laughs> almost broke the kit. If I can carefully do this. Okay, I almost broke the kit and uh, had it to where those three ball joints were very, uh, were basically not going to be able to go in anymore. But when I noticed it, <laughs> uh, I was able to somewhat save it. But if it ever breaks or falls off again, I'll probably just super glue it. Um, but yeah. And then the other issue is that um, his uh, saber holders don't really, uh, I mean they hold, but a lot of the times they'll just fall out. Um, I liked it in the first kit where uh, they would slide right in. Um, the stickers weren't that bad. I thought they were fine. Um, I obviously messed up there, but that's okay. And these little uh, clear things, and be very careful. They're a little weird to put in at first, but if you lose them, whew, it takes a little while to find. <clears throat> and then the other issue is just shield. I mean, it, it it likes to stay on most of the time. This likes to fall off though. And then when he has the uh, effect part on for the shield, that likes to fall off too. So here's a overall look. Put your hand down. Your thumb is backwards. Uh, one hand. Nope. Nope. Can't do it. <laughs> Rotate. What I like about it is that the uh, joints aren't very stiff. I mean, they're stiff enough, but they're not like super stiff. So yeah, what I was talking about how uh, back heavy this thing is. Um, I'll probably mess it up, so I just won't do anything. Um, <laughs> look at that angle, and look how far, like, it holds him back. So, I mean, this is when I need to buy a stand. And I had an issue where, obviously, uh, it's easy to fix, but I just need to go back in and, uh, readjust what's in there. Because, uh, when this expands out, it, like, lifts it up, and, uh, I guess it's just not properly placed in. And um, the uh, this one turned out to be a lot looser than this one. This uh, jet was a lot more stiff, and I would say correct. This one's very loose and would slide down a lot. But uh, yeah, overall, this thing was really cool. And uh, yeah, so plans are to panel line it. And then, uh, if I want to, then I will, uh, custom paint it. But for now, I'll leave it, just because I like it a lot. But yeah, this one, I didn't show you any of the effect parts. It's just, I haven't really snipped them out yet. And as well as, uh, I just wanted to show you the base of it. And it's very cool. Gun's a lot cooler. I like this design better than the first one. But yes.
Thank you for watching. Peace.